Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. We all know fall weekend belongs to football and the great eating experience of tailgating. Our next guest has scored big and has worked with some of the greats, such as Diana Ross, Usher, and more. Here to show us how to take a crowd-pleasing tailgate recipe and bring it to Sister Circle, please welcome Chef Juan Montier. Thank you so much thank for having me. You thank you, for thank you, thank you. Thank here. you. Yes, uh, now, we're going to start with some of your background first. You were known as an architect with an interior design business before you got into the cooking business. So what made you get into the culinary business? Well, you know, I, um, I did a, a, a reality cooking show. Mm -hmm. And my wife, who's my business partner and friend, right, yeah, partner friend. Uh, gave me permission to pursue my passion. All right. And Shea Montier, the catering business, was born. Yes. And, uh, and it's been 14 years since wow. then. Wow. Well, as an architect, before you even put your artwork, your eat work, on a plate, you put it on paper. And Why do you do that? Well, people ask why. It's because your eyes eat before your mouth does. That's true, yes. I mean, your eyes eat before your mouth does. And I believe that the food has to be as, as beautiful as it is delicious. Mm -hmm. It just makes, you know, Woo. sexy food. We, we did a... Um, we did food for um, for pastors, and they said they didn't want no way to own sexy food, but they wanted sexy food after Everyone all. Everyone's sexy food at the end of the they day. They sure did. And you've actually received all access to Tyler Perry Studios' grand opening. Oh, so how was that? That was that was an amazing experience. Mm -hmm. We we did all of the uh, all the VIP food and mm -hmm. all of the green room food, and just to see how powerful all the power that was there mm -hmm. just. And all of our all of our young team, my son was there, uh, and all of his uh, associates, and they just it just it was transformative. Well, speaking of transformative power, <laughs> let's get this meal together. What are we making today? We are making taco soup. Ooh! Taco soup is uh, a, a, a new take on chili. Okay. Okay. You know, now I'm a, I'm a gourmet chef. You know, we do fragois, caviar, <laughs> blah blah blah. Here, here. But. <laughs> I stole this recipe from my mother-in-law, who oh, nice. I happen to love. Mm -hmm. You know, all the other mother-in-laws I've had. You know, well, while we talk about the mama, we're going to cook. We're going to cook daytime because television. we've got, we have got a, 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 a ground beef browning. Ground beef browning. And what we're going to do, this is so easy. This is a dump and turn recipe. Okay, so let's dump it on okay, in while so we talk. Okay, so we start off with the red kidney beans. Mm -hmm. Boom. Boom. And you know when we do this, we make sure that we use all of the so liquid okay. from the from really? the cans to everything, and, and we just dump it right that? in. Look, look like hominy. That's what's hominy. That? Oh, I'm sorry, kidney beans, white hominy, mm -hmm. and this is rot. Can I say that? Rotel. This is rot rotel. It's rotel. <laughs> Diced tomatoes with peppers and onions. Diced tomatoes with peppers and onions. Yes. Black beans. Mm -hmm. Oopsie. And what what kind of things pair well with this dish? <laughs> you got them right here. Chips and dip. Mm. And we're also going to be uh, serving these, um, our take on vegetable crudités. So it's taste. more like a chili dip kind of thing. Like well, a dippy chili? This is a dippy chili. Yes, you a can dip. A dippy chili. Oh, yeah. So why don't you tell us some of your, your favorite homecoming or tailgating memories while we stir this on up? Well, I want you to know that, uh, but before I do that, I want to, the secret ingredient What's is the secret ingredient? taco soup powder. Taco soup powder. And, um... Ranch dressing powder. Well, the secret is out, so it's no longer it a secret ingredient. But thank is. you for sharing but it with us. I have to tell you that my first experience with tailgating on a, in a on an intimate scale was we did the tailgate party for the AKAs last year. All right, Rashawn, be happy about and that. It was off the. I have never. We served. We served a, a, a vegan gumbo base, mm -hmm. and they had all of this, all of the, these were actually all full with crab and lobster and mm. pork belly and shrimp. Oh, so you just come to us and just give us the meat without the, the, uh, the, the well, all the uh, yeah. lobsters and shrimp and stuff. Here, if you're going to stir, stir these in, yes, too. This is, just it makes it in. pretty. Now, how long do we let this simmer as for? As soon as it gets hot, you can eat it. What? You, the hominy doesn't have to cook dinner? No, sometimes the hominy, hominy everything in them cans are already cooked. All right, so while we're, while we're cooking over here, you made a cookbook, so tell us about it. Your, your, your cookbook. Well, because uh, our uh, our philosophy is your eyes eat before your mouth does, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I would make these sketches for my team to know what the food is supposed to look like, these mm -hmm. intricate little appetizers. And uh, my clients got wind of it. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> my clients got wind of it, and they decided that mm. they wanted it for themselves. Well, let's take a look at it. Where is it? And my wife is an entrepreneur. Where and book? where is that book? I... Well, while we're waiting for the book, we're going we're gonna to do the BAM Surprise Kitchen 
Um, and through the miracle through the of miracle. kitchen magic. What y'all got in here? I smell food. <laughs> I'm going to get it. And we got, now I want you to know like that, that this could oh be made goodness. with beef or turkey. Oh, this and so this good. particular mm -hmm. version is made turkey? Just put it right on here. Mm. turkey. Mm -hmm. So that's the magic turkey. Yeah. So, oh. Oh. oh, that's it there. This yeah. looks and smells D-E-E-E-E-E-E-Licious. My okay? God. So what, what encouraged you? Senator Stern, would you stir this in? Yes. Me? Excuse what, me, please. Okay, oh, what yes. encouraged you to, um, to do the book? Yeah. Uh, again, my, my clients always wanted a, a, a sketch for themselves because they, mm -hmm. they would end up with a dossier of sketches okay. for their for their events. Uh -huh. And uh, my wife, being the entrepreneur that she is, yeah. just decided to make money off of it and make it into a so book. So I don't want to well, put my hands Congratulations oh, you to, to you, you and can. your wife on uh, celebrating a 20, 21 years of anniversary, right? 21 years yes. of, of, joy and, of joy and happiness, yes. I must say. Yes. Well, can, do you mind if I dress a little cheese? You go ahead and have the cheese. I don't mind. We're right. going to have our own joy and happiness. So no, thank you, Chef Juan. We're going to eat your food. Oh, thank geez. you for making this game day recipe a breeze. And thank you for having me. Watch us on Shea Montier. Yes, social media, shemontier.com. Boom, he said it for me. So